Hi guys, I'm Pratiksha Ranjan and here is my new project, Manage Jobs. So in this pro project, we are basically making a placement portal where you can manage all your students as well as the job opportunities that are being posted on your portal. So to use all the features, firstly, you need to sign in uh, to the project. In case you don't have an account here, firstly, you need to sign up and then only you can sign in. In my case, I have already made my account so I can directly sign in. Uh, as you can see that I have signed in, uh, so I can see a lot of a uh, lot of buttons here on the header which says add student add interview download reset password and sign out and here i can see a list of students and uh, the upcoming interviews uh, so let's start with adding one more student so here i need to add the name as you can see that I have already filled all the details which are being required while, ma while making another student. Uh, so I can just click on add student. So after clicking on the add student button on that page, we are being redirected to this profile page where I can see that Pratik has been added as another student. So uh, with students, we can view their details. You can see all the details of this student. We can add an interview. To add an interview, I just need to enter the email ID and the company name. Let's name it Wahi2. Uh, enter the date of the interview and click on edit student. I can see that the student has been edited. As I go back, I can see that uh, and that another in, uh, interview has been added in this list. And uh, I can also view the details of the relevant interview as in which student has applied to add another interview i need to click on add interview button and enter the name of the industry and uh, the date so i am again redirected to this page and uh, i can see that wahi has been added another uh, as another interview i can uh, download all these details that uh, we have just made by just click, uh, clicking on this download button. As I click on the download button, I can see that a data file has been downloaded in the CSV format. It will look something like this, which will uh, have the name, the email, uh, the badge status, and all the details of the student. And at last, if you want to reset the password of our uh, of our app, we just need to click on the reset button, uh, reset password button. And uh, if we are done with our work, we can just sign out. So we have signed out successfully. Uh, for your reference, the GitHub link and uh, uh, and the hosting link has been added in the description below. You can just go through it and let me know if you have any doubts in the comment section below. Thank you.